The live mode, also known as the voice mode, is probably one of my favorite features in the Gemini AI because you can use it to have a nice and natural conversation with AI by just speaking. Unfortunately, when I'm recording this video, that feature is still available for the mobile app version. It's not yet to be released for the desktop version. So right now, if you are using a desktop computer, then you must use an Android emulator like BlueStars, Nox Players, or Memu to run an Android operating system and then log in with your cool account and therefore you can start using Gemini as you are using it in the mobile app version. So here's how you can use the live mode or the voice mode on Gemini. So I'm going to be using an emulator on my computer and I'm going to launch Gemini. Alright, so to use the live mode or the voice mode, you just need to tap on this icon and I'll show you a few things that you can do with this AI feature. Hi there, how are you today? I'm doing well, thanks for asking. How about you? What's on your mind today? I'm feeling good. I just want to ask you about what is the most important AI news today? There's a lot happening in the world of AI right now. Just today, there have been some interesting developments in AI coding tools. Would you like to hear more about that? Or is there a specific okay, just, area just of give AI me one. you're interested in? Just give me one that you think is the most interesting. Well, one of the biggest stories today is about how AI is being used to help create new materials. Researchers are using machine learning to design materials with specific properties, which could lead to breakthroughs in everything from medicine to construction. Okay, okay, that's awesome. But I need you uh, to actually help me understand what's going on on my Android phone screen. Okay, I'm here to help. Could you describe what you're seeing on your screen? Uh, you Can you see what's going on on the screen? I want to know what are the apps at the bottom of the screen. Okay, I see the apps at the bottom of your screen. You've got One Punch Man the Strongest, Tokyo Ghoul Awakening, and Dragon Nest Rebirth of Legend. Are you looking for information on any of these games? Nothing, I just want to know the name. Thank you so much for answering the question. No problem. It was fun chatting about those games. Do you have any other questions for me today? Nothing, that's it for today. Thank you so much for having a nice conversation with me. You're very welcome. I enjoyed our conversation too. Have a great rest of your day. And there it goes. So Gemini is actually able to see what's going on on the screen. And it, you can also interrupt when Gemini is speaking. So if there's something that you want to correct or you want to change the duration of the conversation, you can obviously do that. And yeah, I use this feature a lot because, you know, it's always nice to have a conversation without having to type a long paragraph. So go ahead, use the live or the voice mode on Gemini. And if there is a new update, if of the possibility of the voice version or the voice mode on the desktop version, then I would definitely uh, make a video about it. But that's about it. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you on my next video.